Welcome to Easy Driver, the most reliable source of automotive information on YouTube. Please like, share, comment and subscribe. Revolutionizing the road, the rise of sustainable automotive materials. The automotive industry is facing a major reckoning. As concern for the environment continues to grow, car manufacturers are under pressure to reduce their ecological footprint. One key area of focus is the development of sustainable materials. For decades, the industry has relied on non-renewable resources like steel, aluminum, and petroleum-based plastics. But with the global push towards a more circular economy, companies are now racing to find innovative, eco-friendly alternatives. From plant-based composites to recycled metals, the range of sustainable materials being explored is vast. But what does this shift mean for the future of the automotive industry? And how will it impact the cars we drive? In this video, we'll explore the latest developments in sustainable automotive materials and what they mean for the road ahead. The current state of automotive materials. As we hit the roads in our cars, few of us stop to think about the materials that go into making them. But the truth is, the automotive industry is one of the largest consumers of materials in the world, and the choices we make about those materials have a significant impact on the environment. In this section, we'll take a closer look at the traditional materials that have dominated the industry for decades, and why it's time to start thinking about more sustainable alternatives. Traditional materials, steel, aluminum, and plastics. For decades, the automotive industry has relied on a familiar trio of materials, steel, aluminum, and plastics. Steel is the strongest and most widely used of the three, accounting for about 70% of the average vehicle's weight. Aluminum is a close second, prized for its lightweight strength and corrosion resistance. Plastics, meanwhile, are used for everything from dashboards to bumpers. But despite their ubiquity, these materials have some serious drawbacks. Steel production is a major source of greenhouse gas emissions, accounting for around 7% of global emissions. Aluminum mining has been linked to deforestation, water pollution, and human rights abuses. Plastics, meanwhile, are a major contributor to waste and pollution, with millions of tons of plastic waste ending up in oceans and landfills each year. And then there's the issue of weight. The heavier the vehicle, the more fuel it consumes, and the more emissions it produces. With the average vehicle weighing in at around 4,000 pounds, it's no wonder that the automotive industry is one of the largest consumers of fossil fuels in the world. The need for sustainable alternatives. So what's the solution? Clearly, we need to start thinking about more sustainable alternatives to traditional materials. But what does that mean, exactly? For starters, it means reducing our reliance on fossil fuels and lowering our carbon footprint. It means finding materials that are lighter, stronger, and more efficient. And it means designing vehicles that are not just better for the environment, but better for people too. The good news is that researchers and manufacturers are already working on a new generation of sustainable materials. From plant-based composites to advanced metals and polymers, the possibilities are endless. And with the right combination of innovation, investment, and policy support, we can create a more sustainable future for the automotive industry and for the planet. Emerging Sustainable Materials in the Automotive Industry as the world shifts towards a more environmentally conscious future, the automotive industry is under pressure to adapt and innovate. One key area of focus is the development of sustainable materials that can reduce the industry's ecological footprint. In this section, we'll explore some of the most promising emerging materials that are set to revolutionize the way cars are made. Bioplastics and Biocomposites Bioplastics and biocomposites are made from renewable biomass sources such as cornstarch, sugarcane, or potato starch. These materials have several benefits, including reduced greenhouse gas emissions, lower energy consumption, and a decrease in dependence on fossil fuels. However, there are also challenges to overcome, such as higher production costs, limited durability, and the potential for land use changes. Imagine a car interior made from a bioplastic that's not only sustainable but also biodegradable. Sounds like science fiction, right? But it's not. 
Companies like Ford and Toyota are already experimenting with bioplastics in their vehicles. For example, Ford's Explorer features a bioplastic-based interior that's made from a combination of corn starch and sugarcane. The benefits of bioplastics and biocomposites are clear, but there are still hurdles to overcome. For instance, these materials can be more expensive to produce than traditional plastics, and their durability is still a concern. However, as technology advances and economies of scale improve, we can expect to see more widespread adoption of these sustainable materials. Recycled and Recyclable Materials Using recycled and recyclable materials in automotive production is another way to reduce waste and minimize the industry's environmental impact. This approach not only conserves natural resources but also reduces the amount of waste sent to landfills. Did you know that the average car contains around 100 pounds of recyclable materials? That's a significant amount of waste that can be reduced or eliminated altogether. Companies like Honda and BMW are already using recycled materials in their vehicles, from recycled aluminum to reclaimed plastics. The potential for using recycled and recyclable materials in automotive production is vast. For example, recycled aluminum can be used to make engine blocks, cylinder heads, and other components. Similarly, reclaimed plastics can be used to make interior components, such as dashboards and door panels. Advanced Materials, Carbon Fiber and Graphene Carbon fiber and graphene are two advanced materials that are gaining traction in the automotive industry. Carbon fiber is a lightweight, high-strength material that's perfect for making car bodies and chassis components. Graphene, on the other hand, is a highly conductive material that's ideal for making advanced electronics and batteries. Carbon fiber is already being used in high-performance vehicles, such as the BMW i8 and the Tesla Model S. However, its high production cost and limited scalability are major challenges. Graphene, on the other hand, is still in its infancy, but its potential is vast. Imagine a car battery that's not only more efficient but also lighter and more durable. That's the promise of graphene. While carbon fiber and graphene are exciting developments, there are still significant challenges to overcome. For instance, carbon fiber production is energy intensive and graphene is still a relatively new material that requires further research and development. However, as technology advances and economies of scale improve, we can expect to see more widespread adoption of these advanced materials. In the next part, we'll dive into the emerging sustainable materials that are set to revolutionize the industry. Stay tuned for part 2. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe for more automotive information like this. Thank you for watching.